Welcome to the Keith and the Girl After Show. Today's exciting episode was with Jenna Marucci. Hello. And I was hitting on her the whole time, which uh, could be weird, except nobody cares. So that's nice. Well, nobody believes this celibacy bullshit anyway. <laughs> Hello, Jenna. How are you? Good. How are you? We're going to have a real good time today. Hemda's going to describe movie trailers mm-hmm. without hearing them. She knows nothing about movies, less about actors and actresses. And our job okay. is to name the correct movie. There'll be three rounds at least. Mm-hmm. First one, one point, then two points, then three points. Okay. It's going to be very, very exciting. I'm very excited. Whoever wins, wins nothing. Hemda? Now, here's the thing. I am skewing a little towards Jenna because I know that you're very into rom-coms. I know that you're not. You're going to and this is the first yeah. time I'm picking based on theme. These are all rom-coms or in the area of rom-coms. Or, mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. How do you think you'll do, Keith? Great. You don't know what movies are. Platoon. <laughs> That's true. <All> right. <laughs> Maybe Platoon is a rom-com. All right. Here we go. Is it Platoon? Okay. No. I'm, I'm pressing so excited. play. All right. First one is from 1989. So we're going back a little bit. Uh, it's a guy in a car talking. Uh, we don't see the other person. Yet, now we do see the other person. Nice, he comes in. And she's driving, she's talking to him. They look like they're having a very casual conversation. In the same car. Yes, and now uh, he's offering her grapes in the car, and she's kind of snubbing it, like, ah, fuck it. When Harry met Sally. That's right. Okay. <laughs> All right. I think I was busy fucking that year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, we're moving forward to 2002. Jenna, it's one point to you, zero to Keith. This is worth two points. Here we go. All right, let's see. Mm-hmm-hmm. Gold circle, play tone. All right, um, a guy is uh, walking in saying hello to someone. She stands up and goes get something, but she gets stuck with her headset and falls down um, because she's walking away with a headset on that pulls her and she's down. Oh, They're crazy. walking on the bridge. They're now sitting and having dinner. They're on the bridge talking. The truth about cats and dogs. He's kissing her. Now he's meeting her whole family, and they're very big. Oh, uh, my, my big fat regretting. That's correct. Yes. Keith? That headphone move right. is in a couple movies. So, so is I was it like, really? Oh, yeah. It's in The Devil Wears Prada. It's in The Truth About... Uh, the um, one with Catherine Heigl and Gerard Butler. Something about... They both are in the right. news. Well, that's a go-to move. Keith Malley. That's why I was confused. Keith Malley. All right. This is your kryptonite, it looks like. I think so. All right, now this one was the hardest one. I, I've seen those two. I, this is, I never saw this one. Right, this is worth three points. So three, you have three. I have nothing, but this is worth three oh points. Oh, no. So, okay. okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm so competitive. 1999. Press and play. Okay. Polygram Film Entertainment. Love their work. <laughs> Do you want to forfeit? Uh, the usual British guy who's she, in every rom-com. Okay, four weddings and a funeral. No. And then... Notting Hill. Yes. Fuck! Ah, no! Sorry! No! Wait, can we do a tiebreaker? Well, yeah, I'm gonna do a tiebreaker. Okay, sorry. Oh my god, I'm so competitive. <laughs> oh I could god. see Keith waking this up on that one. This is such a fun... Oh man, if I could get paid to know all the rom-coms for no fucking reason. Oh man. Are you ready for this one? This is the tiebreaker. It's worth four points. It is now three to three. Oh my okay. god. 2001, I'm pressing play. Okay. I'm so mad if I don't get this. Here we go. Rated R. Okay. Okay. Ooh, this is so nerve wracking. I love it. Miramax Home Entertainment, Universal, Studio Canal. Uh, she's walking with a bunch of commuters. She's throwing Sliding out. Sliding doors. No, she's throwing out a book. She's throwing out cigarettes. She's throwing out her oh, booze. Bridget Jones Diary. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Jenna's crying. This is all she had. Woo! <laughs> I literally have a PhD in rom com, <laughs> and I have failed. I have failed you. <laughs> what do you? What do you? What do you? You? Huh? So you get your PhD in rom coms? Yeah. You're being literal, right? I mean, it's just that I I know rom com movies okay. very well, and I I thought read... you really had a doctor. <laughs> no, 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 I believe no, you. no, 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 because then I'd be like a writer. No, I and I was a really bad reader in school, so I would never finish a book. Um, but when I started reading romance novels, my mom in high school was like, "Well, at least you're reading, you dumb fuck." So <laughs> I then I've read all I've read so many romance novels, and I watched the fucking rom coms. The 
the year is what you know what there's no excuse Jenna you fucking lost you stupid bitch I'm gonna go home and twitch about it how did you how did you come stronger later I feel like you oh started thinking a little bit more I don't I, I was all in the whole time mm. I happened to see Notting Hill I remember it was counter programming the Star Wars but uh, I'm an adult <laughs> and I can see more than one thing so I saw both of those and then what was the last one? Bridget Jones Diary. Yeah. Bridget Jones Diary. That one's famous. That I forget so her throwing. I forget the shot of her throwing out stuff. That's what did it for me. I don't I remember her like, throwing stuff out, but I remember she's going to change her whole life all of a sudden. But all of them are going to change their whole life. <laughs> Damn it, you guys. <laughs> but on this topic, have you seen To All the Boys I've Loved? Or no? All the no. guys, all the men I've loved before? No, boys? that's good. No, it's boys. Because she's in high school. Um, it's on Netflix and it's pretty good. I okay. Don't, I don't have time for high school bullshit. <laughs> no, but it's very sweet. Okay. Yeah, and it's like well done. There's Sounds also good. there's another one on Netflix that's good. But yeah, yeah. I'll I take a look at that. I, you know what? I think this rematch is going to be really great. So keep listening to Keith and the girl. Oh my gosh! Don't I'm forget a- to subscribe to this channel and turn on the bell. And if you like this round, make sure you hit the like button. You know, thumbs up, thumbs down, and comment. Jenna, you can comment too on this. Just All be right. Like, I knew it, but I just. I wanted to give Keith a rom-com for his birthday. Men run the world, men. Men run the world, men. Oh, God, that is the worst song ever. (laughs) Oh, man. I'll comment on it. (laughs) That I want to rematch. All right. Thank you all very much. Hit subscribe, the bell, and we'll talk to you soon.